Hey, Meryl, what's this week's parasha? Vayi. Mm, Vayi gosh. All right, so we were given the Torah. The wisdom and will of the creator of all. The one who is the source of all. Who constantly sustains everyone and everything at every moment. This Tyra, being the guidebook for life, is of course totally brilliant and mind-blowing. It's totally mind-blowingly mind-blowing. It's a secret cheat code. To what? To living life with Hashem. As a partner with Hashem. In the purpose of creation. Yes, that is what it is. Although it's really not much of a secret. And it's certainly not cheating. Although it does make life so much better. However, although it's no secret, we do sometimes keep one little but extremely important aspect in all of this a secret. A secret from ourselves. From our conscious functioning minds and from the feeling in our beating hearts. Does that sound cheesy? The point is, sometimes we are not thinking about this little but extremely important aspect. And we need to. What is this little but extremely important aspect? Well, it's not just that we were given the Torah. And not even, and not only that God is the author of this Torah, but that God gives us the Torah. This is the secret that we weren't only given the Torah, but we are given the Torah. Hashem gives us the Torah in the present day and moment, in the now. So the Torah is holy, of course. And it's not just some deeply intellectual wisdom or brilliant philosophy. It is holy and not only holy, but relevant. It is a holiness that is of personal relevance every day anew to you and to me, to us, the Jew. And hey, as we learn about Yosef, in these Torah portions and we see how Yosef has kept it successfully in his conscious mind, the fact that God is the one orchestrating every single detail of life at every moment. We should do this too. Live in Mashiach mode. You can't, you can't really not live in Mashiach mode when you keep this in mind constantly. Live with more joy. Live with more love. Do another mitzvah and study more Torah. And the point is, even if you're going to sit on your couch and do absolutely nothing of the things that I just suggested we do, Hashem should send us Mashiach already to be revealed immediately.